What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to compile uh, FPPS4. And to do that, we're first going to head to the page. And as you can see, it literally says nothing about how to compile it because, you know, that's just how things are done these days. But instead, I'm going to show you how. So we're going to go to trunk. You're going to hit download zip. And it's going to download a zip, okay? Then, what you're going to want to do after that, after it finishes downloading 7,000 years from now, is, I'm going to pop this actually in my documents, you're going to right click it right here and extract it, okay? Now, there are two programs that you need to be able to compile this thing. And yes, they are very, very important. I'm going to drag those in as well. You're going to need uh, FPC 3.2.2. Make sure it's the 64-bit version. It will come with the 32-bit as well. And you need the Lazarus IDE, okay? So once you have both of those installed, there's not really any options for them, so just install them. You're going to want to open up this. Double-click this. It's going to open up the IDE. And you're going to hit Build. And as long as there's no errors, you are literally done and built. Now, the EXEs that it does build are going to be directly in the same file right here. So that's it. The emulator is built. Honestly, the fact that this is one minute long really kind of shows that uh, this is a lot easier than I originally thought it was. Now, the reason you cannot build the current branch is because this does not exist. Which is annoying. But it is what it is. Anyway, that's how you compile FPPS4. Thank you for watching.